Learning new things can quickly feel like a superpower. I have compiled the top 10 AI tools designed to help you learn faster, understand complex topics easily, and manage your research effectively. These apps all have fantastic free versions, so you can start using them right away. Check them out in the description below. Let's go! First up is Open Read Academy, a powerful platform that gives you access to millions of research papers and summarizes them in seconds. On Open Read, you can search for terms and you will get answered by Oat, which is their AI assistant. And you will get a summary based on other papers that have been uploaded or from the web, which you can switch very easily. It also will give you citations and the sources from which it took the information. And if you have any further questions about the information, you can always click on Ask Follow Questions to get more information. You can also upload your own paper where you're going to get a couple more tools to work with. For example, Paper Espresso, which pretty much means that it's going to quickly extract and summarize key points of the research paper and essentially provide you a concentrated version of it. You also have the option that is called Paper Q&A, which pretty much means you can chat with your document and extract any particular information you might need. With the free version, you get five Paper Espressos, five Paper Q&As, chats and answers from Oat per month, but also unlimited PDF uploads and parsing, as well as search for papers, which makes it perfect for research or diving deeper into more important papers that you might need to research. But what if you need to dive deeper into a paper and really understand the content? That's where Explain Paper comes in, a tool that simplifies complex academic language, makes the text easier to read, and it gives you key insights that you might need. Simply upload your research paper, highlight the part that you want explained, and Explain Paper will break down the complex terminology and jargon into easier to understand language. What's really cool is that you can adjust the level of explanation. It can explain as a five-year-old, a middle schooler, a high schooler, an undergrad, up to an expert level. You can also ask unlimited follow-up questions all in the free version, which is great. Now that you can easily understand academic papers with Explain Paper, let's move on to Humata AI, a tool that takes summarization to the next level. Its advanced algorithms let you quickly get to the heart of any paper and identify key concepts. For non-researchers, it's very helpful for managing documents. When you upload your document, it instantly summarizes the whole thing, as well as it gives you some example follow-up questions that you can also think of your own. And of course, it will highlight the place that the text was used for the answer. Another cool thing is you can actually listen to the answer if you don't feel like reading. The best part for me is the suggested draft report that it will give you based on the document. It is incredible. The free plan does have some limitations, but it is a great tool to try out and then use on your most important documents. Don't forget to check out the description box for the link to Humata. Now that we have explored tools for finding and summarizing papers, let's talk about organizing and connecting your research. Recall is a great note-taking and knowledge management tool that helps you make sense of your research and identify new connections. It's the go-to tool for people who prefer to learn through different online resources like podcasts and YouTube videos. So I'm going to upload a YouTube documentary on one of my favorite topics, which is supercontinents. And let's see what Recall does. You can also use the browser extension to save any online resource you're looking at to the app. Once a YouTube video has been uploaded, it has created a summary of the entire video. The highlighted words of the text are actually terms that have been created to be like links or additional cards that are all collected at the bottom of the document. And by clicking on them, you can get more information on those specific terms. Of course, you have the option to edit the text to make it more your own. A really cool feature they have is that you can actually create flashcards or a quiz to test your own knowledge on this specific topic. Remember those cards that I was just mentioning? You can actually expand on any of the terms that you have saved here and you can create a whole note and then link it to other related notes and create a knowledge network. But Recall also lets you build a visual network of your research. You can create notes and connect them to each other to show more relationships and easily add images. This will help you get the bigger picture and make connections between different pieces of your research. The free plan only allows you for 10 AI summaries, but you do get unlimited in-app knowledge cards. This tool is absolutely amazing when it comes to visualizing all your research. Where was it when I was in school? 
While Recall uses a visual approach to note-taking, now let's look at RevNote, which offers a different, equally powerful way to organize your research. It's designed specifically to help students learn faster and better. You can easily write your own notes on any topic that you need to learn, and right here you can create your own flashcards. These flashcards can come in the format of questions and answers, list-based answers, and fill-in-the-blank cards. What's super useful is that you can actually test your knowledge and based on how well you know the answers, it will set a timer for when the card will show again. So they have designed this with spaced repetition so you can really learn the material in your notes. You also have the option to upload PDFs or YouTube videos or really anything else on this platform and the AI will generate you a whole test. So these questions are going to be randomly selected and you're not going to know what's in them so you better know your material. Another great app for mind mapping, note taking and spaced repetition flashcards is Traverse. It's great for organizing information and helping you learn it and make useful connections. You can create boards which are called Traverses, which would be the database for any subject, project, book, etc. In each board, you can then create notes and make connections between them. This creates mind mapping, showing the relationships between concepts, which is great for people who prefer to visually memorize information. For each note, you can then create flashcards or fill in the blank cards quite easily. Similarly to RemNote, it has the spaced repetition feature. Based on how well you know the answers and when you set for the flashcard to appear again. With the free plan, you can create three boards or a hundred notes. This next tool is probably one of my favorite ones from the list. Noe is a powerful tool that provides insights and answers any problems and research questions. I know I already said this about one of the previous tools, but boy do I wish I had this tool back in school, especially in math class. I needed all the help I could get. You can type or upload your question and get a full answer with some similar follow-up questions suggested. What's amazing is that you can simply upload a screenshot of a problem and it will give you not just the answer, but also a breakdown of the explanation. And if the explanation needs an explanation, you can always use the follow-up question option. With the Chrome extension, you can simply browse the web, highlight any text, and choose to get an answer on that, an explanation or summary. You can also use the chat option to ask any type of question or the scholar search option for academic research questions specifically. What's really cool is that the free plan renews daily and it includes the homework helper, advanced scholar search, and passes AI detector. But what if you need help with writing and editing your research papers? Jenny AI is a tool that assists with writing and editing and it provides advanced grammar and spell checking. You can give a prompt about what you would like to write and select the outline in which you would want to get the text. The outline option in this tool is great because it gives a structure to the whole text and makes writing much easier. You can accept the writing suggestion, add different formats of heading, numbering, code blocks, or even citations. The magic of this tool lies in the AI commands feature where you can ask Jenny to play around with the text even more. It has the option to improve fluency, write an opposing argument, make the text longer, translate, and paraphrase and simplify the text in different tones. Isn't this incredible? Unfortunately, the reference list isn't available in the free plan, but you do get the AI commands, unlimited PDF uploads, and 200 AI words that renew every day. Jenny AI turns writing into a collaborative experience where you and the AI are working together to create something incredible. If you want to write faster and better, give it a try. Next up, we have another super powerful tool which has so many awesome features after their latest update. I'm talking about SciSpace, and let me show you all the amazing things you can do with one app. You can start off by asking a question. What this tool does is gather concise answers from different papers, and it gives you a summarized answer with citations. Below, you can also find relevant papers. This is great because it makes research so much easier. Another great tool in SciSpace is Find Topics. You can go deeper within research papers to extract insightful topics. What it does is give you summarized answers and also extract the main topics with definitions and again, citations. Some of the other tools that includes are an AI writer, similar to Jenny AI, chatting with PDFs, a paraphraser in different styles, citation generator, a data extraction tool from uploaded PDFs, 
and an AI detector. And my favorite one is the PDF to video. Here you upload a research article and it transforms it to slides and to narrated video. Welcome to our exploration of the fascinating evolution of our understanding of space and time. It is great if you want to understand a paper by listening to the summary or if you would like to present your own research in a nice and efficient way. The link to SciSpace is in the description below, so don't forget to check it out. And finally, we have Capacities. This app is perfect for organizing thoughts, connecting ideas, and building your own personal knowledge base, all in one beautiful AI-enhanced workspace. It looks very similar to Notion, but let's see what its features are and how you can use it to level up your studying and research game. The main feature of Capacities is its ability to organize your notes and thoughts. They call it object-based note-taking and it lets you create notes with text, images, or links, which the tool then automatically tags and categorizes them into thematic collections, so everything stays neatly organized. This helps keep everything structured and easy to find. You can connect related notes and concepts by pretty much just tagging them with relevant tags that they have in common, and that will connect them together and create a beautiful web of knowledge. This way you can gain a deeper understanding and see patterns easier. And you will also see how your ideas interrelate over time. These are just a few functions, but I do invite you to explore it on your own. It's a great personal organizer. And there you have it. These 10 AI tools ranging from research aid to writing assistant and knowledge organizing show just how powerful AI can be in transforming the way we study and learn. Give them a try and let us know in the comments if they have helped you. And of course, what other tools would you like us to review? Thank you for hanging out and I will see you in the next one.